final, final on the red corner, weighing in at 69.8. He's 17, stands at 6 tall. He fights out of submission, MMA, and hails from Barnsley, Charlie Hudson. And his opponent, fighting out the blue corner, weighing in at 70.2. He's 20, stands 5 at 10. He fights out of dungeon, MMA, and hails from Stockton on tees, Luke. The Pop Richardson, your referee, Mr. Neil Hall. Good evening, once again, ladies and gentlemen. On to the second bout of the evening, we have Charlie Hodgson in the red corner making his debut, representing Submission MMA, taking on Luke Richardson, also making his debut from Dungeon MMA. I'm Connor Halliday, alongside Danny Missing, and Mr. Neil Hall is getting us underway. Should be an debuts. Yeah, should so. be an interesting matchup. The Dungeon lads are a submission specialists and. The other gym's called Submission MMA, so we shall see. You don't say the Dungeon Lads are Submission Specialists. <laughs> I've seen knockout after knockout from those guys. Yeah, and I'm pretty sure the Dungeon Lads are undefeated on Almighty, so we'll uh, we'll see if Luke Richard can, Richardson can keep that trend going tonight. You know, if you, do, if you don't come away with win now, right, I hope he comes and batters you for cursing him. <laughs> Just a nice little feeling out process here. They're starting to land a bit more, quite kick heavy as we start out here. Yeah. We've already had a Superman punch and a spinning back kick from uh, Charlie Hodgson, so looks like he's uh, got a few kicks in his uh, in his vocabulary. Oh, inside leg kick there, uh, just shin to shin. That's not going to feel nice tomorrow. Nice Rip. body shot there from Richardson. Oh, bit of a low blow there. Both guys seem quite calm, though, to say they're making their debut. Yeah, I just think that um, Richardson seen something. Uh, Hodgson leaves his hands quite low. Yeah, he seems very like re being relaxed is a good thing, but he seems a bit too, a bit yeah. too relaxed right now. Let's hope he's got really, really good head movement. Yeah, his hands are dropping every time that um, Hodgson moves his legs, which isn't good because then them head, That's them it, head yeah. kicks land. Say up low, take it high. Oh, inside low kick again. MMA Ooh. textbook. Nice. Beautiful return there. Caught the kick, hitting with a low kick of himself. And now we're in a nice front headlock position. Yeah. It looks like he's creeping around. He's rolled him over now. Ends up in side control uh, on the opposite corner. I thought for a second from that uh, front headlock, he was going to go for a necktie. Yeah. I would have. I would have loved to have seen that, especially in a debut. What more can you do? It's one thing I know Danny Missing likes, it's a necktie. I, I just like it when people stop breathing. <laughs> <laughs> We've got Richardson on top now in side control, keep, keeping his weight down nice and heavy. Not really giving Hodgson a chance to move right now. Passes to Neon Belly. Just looking to slide that foot across, but it'd have been a bad mistake there. It's a good job it didn't come to anything because too close at cage for that. Yeah, no rushing from either lads either, so this is a good thing to see in a debut fight. What I would like to see is him just step over into half guard, especially that close to cage, and sit on the hip. He's gone to mount, but the problem here is if Hodgson's got anything about him, he's going to walk that cage. And he sacrificed his balance by going to mount. Oh, he doesn't seem the case, so he's beautiful. jumped on his neck. Hodgson's trying to go head down and just alleviate a little bit of that pressure, but he's trying to go high elbow with the arm on the inside, yeah. is Richardson. And that's just oh, prevented him. Hodgson, yeah. He, he wasn't letting Richardson close his legs either, which obviously is going to help with that guillotine. That's it. And now Hodgson's uh, trying to give him a little bit of payback. We can see him climbing. Brilliant first round. From Beautiful very, first round, yeah. Very, very quick. From a very, from a very, very kind of slow feeling out, out process to uh, scrambles on the ground. It, it was very, very nice. Looking back at that guillotine, the only thing that prevented him on that guillotine was with the um, arming guillotine, you've got to try and take your elbow... Um, on the next side down towards your hip it just allows you to pull through and uh, get a little bit more purchase on the neck um, you can't go straight back and what he actually tried to do was go for the marcellotine and um, the high elbow and the arm that was in was preventing him from getting the arm up over his back just creating a little bit of space for Hodgson to get his head out and uh, capitalize really yeah tiny little things tiny little yeah. things in between uh like you say, you've, you've got to get them little things right to, to secure your submission. That's it. The little things make the big things. And he worked so hard for that position. He got the position. I thought he were a little bit risky close to the fence, but he made the best yeah. of it, caught the guillotine. But just that small little factor after all that big work gave that position away from yeah. him. 
Good first round from both lads, and we're underway for the second round. Uh, see if uh, see if Hodgson can come out a little bit more. Uh, ah, there we go. Oh, Just both like eating leather. But it, for me, it looked like Richardson took the worst of that before he shot in on the uh, on the body look. Beautiful Outside trip. trip down to half guard. Now this is going to play a better factor. Sat on the hip, can't climb the cage. I like giving up half guard close to the cage. Yeah, and he's really close to his corner here as it. well. See that he tried to bridge, but the weight was on his hip. He's managed to fish a. A butterfly hook in and push away. I think Richardson half stepped back, understanding that that position wasn't really oh. good for him. Nice overhand from uh, Hodgson then. They're both, uh, they're both taking yeah. shots here, Danny. I think every strike's a significant strike at the moment. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> There's no playing around in round two. Hey, Beautiful nice. cross up there by Richardson. Went right to the body, left over to the head. Beautiful work from Richardson. And that's it. It may appear that uh, Hodgson's tired, but I think he's just really, really, really Ooh, calm. Low, low blow there from Richardson. Neil Law, referee, calls time there. Probably a good choice. As nobody oh, yeah. likes being hit there. Oh, no, not at all. Not at all. And your corner team could tell you to do a million different things, but nothing works. <laughs> no, you cannot You cannot block a, uh, a groin guard. You've got to do the old uh, jiggling dance yeah. to uh, get them to come back down from your neck or your stomach, depending on how, how high up there they are. Bit of a jiggle and a foot stomp and you'll be sound. Oh, yeah, definitely. <laughs> definitely you see people uh, ping the cups. I don't, I don't know. I, <laughs> that kind of pain makes you do some dumb stuff. <laughs> Yeah, he's uh, just taking his time now. He's got under the uh, unified amateur rules. He's got five minutes. I feel like uh, for his next fight, if, o if Hodgson's going to get clipped in uh, baby makers, he's going to have to learn how to uh, do a dance and you know play it <laughs> out because this here for me is boring. Oh, we, oh, we got a bit of a squat and a pull. <laughs> squat and a pull. Squat and pull. There you go. There you go. We'll carry on for round number two. Richardson comes out strong with a very nice jab. He just looks sharper with his strike, and that was a beautiful body shot from uh, Richardson. Oh, it's those short, short, powerful limbs by Richardson. He's working inside more. That ground and pound. These short little, short little limbs that he's got. He carries a lot of power in this close combat ground and pound. Yeah, Hodgson took a big shot and then he, he tried to give the big head kick and fell to the floor. That's that's how we've ended up in this position with Richardson on top, yeah. and he's just landed some really heavy ground and pound. Hodgson's the rangier of the two. You'd like to see him just maybe, he, his leg range is nice. great, but when he's punching, he allowed Richardson too close to him. That's it. He's just here. Yeah. 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 Taking a very close look. These are young lads, so the referees are going to take a closer look with the younger ones, and it's That's rightfully it. so. Good work from Richardson on top, though. He's not giving uh, Hodgson any space at no, all. No, he isn't. He's making him... He's making him think about his movements, is Richardson. Whereas Hodgson should be maybe moving his arms and his legs and making Richardson feel a little bit unstable if he throws that strike. But his corner told him to get back up and he did. He's done the damage, he scored the points. Yeah. Now, we can't see his face, but Neil, Neil Hall, Hall looked a, bit, a little yeah. bit concerned. Another takedown. And that was nice, he took away that, um, that bad arm position. Where he was just uh, stiff arm in, but this is close to being over. I've heard the 10 second clacker go, and uh, but this is not looking good for. If Richardson wants to put it on him now, he's got to put it on him. These pitter patter shots aren't going to work. And great work from Richardson there in the second round. When he stood back up after that first initial ground and pound, as soon as they stood back up, he faked the faked the strike and shot straight in for the takedown yeah, when did. I, I assume Hodgson thought he were going to come out to try yeah. and knock him out so good work from Richardson he's Very got smart. Hodgson's respect on yeah. the feet now and if you respect someone and this is how I teach if you can get someone to respect your shots they're going to try and block your shots when you try and block it, a shot to your head you're leaving your, your chest your body your, your legs, legs everything exposed it's almost impossible to block a shot to the head and defend a takedown yeah, the cut man's taking a close look at uh, Hodgson here. Looks like it's a mouse under his right eye. Going back to the end of that round, though, um, Richardson were on top, and I heard his corner shout. I won't show if they were aware at the time, but it comes down to fighter IQ, telling your, telling your guy to look for a submission with less than 10 yeah. seconds left on clock, unless that guy's going to snap that shoulder out. 
You want to be you know what I mean? Score some pound, points. Yeah. You've yeah. done the damage. You only need to land a couple of good ones. That he's got a mouse on his eye. You see, every time that gets it, it's going to fill up with blood even more. Hodgson's. Uh, it doesn't look like Hodgson's got his mouth guarding. No, he he doesn't. Oh, he ain't going to pull a Mike Tyson on us. Oh, Beautiful head, head kick. kick there, and it's how Richardson just Richardson just transitions seamlessly from stance to stance. Good shot there from Hodgson. That's it. This is what he needs. You let go of the single, you've got to keep on that single. Well, and now, down. Beautiful, beautiful, rolls him over. And just creating that brace under the arm and across the back of the neck, it manipulates the neck so much. Your body's going to go wherever your head goes. You don't want to break it. You don't want to break that. No, he passes over to Mount quite easily, looking Str for the head oh, He's arm. got the head and arm. He's gone straight over to side control, but Good there's work. a grimace on Hodgson's face right now. It's looking tighter. He's just giving a thumbs up to Neil, but that's not a good position to be in. Ah, and it's touch. over. Great work from Richardson. Beautiful. From the stand up to the ground, everything was on point there. That's, that's where you look for a submission, you yeah. know what I mean? Where yeah. you're not so deep into rounds. You've got plenty of time that's to work. It. You know, not, not not five seconds for end at rounds. You know, give him a couple of licks, you know. Fair play to uh, Charlie Hodgson. Now he, uh, oh, Luke yeah. Richardson gave him everything that he got and he didn't really go down. He got he got no. stuffed and got submitted. So yeah. congratulations to Our both second guys. second round was the turning point yeah. though. Yeah, 100%. Uh, Luke Richardson moves to 1-0 in his debut, representing Dungeon MMA, keeps the unbeaten streak going, which means he's not coming for me, Danny. Uh, but yeah, so Luke Richardson moves to 1-0 and out of Dungeon MMA. We'll hand it over to Safe Khan for our official decision. Five is to the centre of the cage, please. Five is to the centre of the cage. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, after one minute, four seconds of the third round, your referee, Mr. Neil Hall, calls a stop to the fight, declaring your winner by arm triangle, Luke the Pop Richardson. Please show your appreciation for Charlie Hodgson.